Hello everybody, my name is Farmer Phil and today I'm going to be showing you how to automate your farm and this is part 2 and this is the un off offloading the combine using course play. So let's get started. So first things first, we go and we get our combine going and set them up in the field. So as you can see there I'm using uh, Massey Ferguson's. And we're going to be cutting a bit of maize now. It doesn't really matter what you're cutting. The combine unloading works for everything. So hire a worker. And let him work away there. So then you leave him working. You want to go to your tractor. And now we want to start laying the course. So you want to select that one. with Yeah. Combi. Uh, combine offloading. And we want to set him up now. So your start point is where your tractor is going to go to after unloading the combine so it wants to be somewhere that from wherever he is in the field he can get to without running into a hedge or something now in these square fields it's nice and simple but in other maps where fields aren't straight and there's hedges and stuff in the way it can be a lot more difficult so and you also want to start it well into the field you don't want to be too close to him because once he gets to the first waypoint then he has to line up with your rest of your waypoints depending on what angle he comes in at can depend on how big and wide turning angles in this you can always end up running into stuff so you want to do start recording the course and then we want you just drive to wherever you want to un be unloading into so one thing as well you want to try and stick to whatever way the roads work as to just try and avoid running into traffic so I am driving on this side of the road I am yeah and I'm going to unload here at the train station so you just drive on down drive in here now or actually we want to go no where do we want to go ah yeah we can go in here yeah drive in just drive across the your unloading point and now this is a problem with what I'm after doing here that yoke there for refilling you want to avoid driving under that so if you drive under that it'll fill it so you want to skip it, you always got to be careful of that when you're laying these courses for unloading trailers and, and that that if you drive under one of them it will fill it so you have to avoid driving under it so then we just have to drive back to the field and then it's ready to go it's very straightforward very simple, one of the easiest ones to do there's one or two other things I'll just go through when we get back to the field and we're ready to go So back on up the road here and again when you stop in the field you want to be in a place that no matter where he is he'll be able to reach without running into stuff so corner of the field or you also want to make sure he isn't going to stop where he's going to be in the way to come and that's another thing so where he was about to stop there he was going to be in the way so we can stop him there that's grand drive course at the very start he's looking for a combine now I find that on automatic search it never finds a combine but it might actually have found it now but what, normally what I do is I go to manual and then select my combine and it has the distances on it so if you did have two combines working you'd be able to select the right one and in other settings we can go to speeds leave that alone um, yeah this one the side offset, fertile offset, turn and circle that's they're fairly straightforward they work fairly well your star hat and your drive on it so the drive on it means if he's above 90% full he'll continue he'll go to follow the combine when it reaches 90% so if I will wait for the combine to turn and be going down the line and then I'll start dropping that and to get him to go after the combine so we'll just wait for him to do his turn and drive across the crop as you do I have crop destruction mod and as you can see he's leaving it behind and he's actually you're going to back, you better back over the field. Yeah, it's been actually that long since I used ha just higher worker for coming and I always use course plays. I normally play on different maps than this, but just for the purpose of making these videos, it's a lot easier to use this. So now we'll start dropping this. Drops in 5%. So, yeah, no, he's at 40%, so now he'll drive behind the combine. So he will align himself fairly well. Sometimes he can run in get in the way the other worker and everything comes to a stop but most of the time it works fairly well he'll drive under you can also set 
if you were using course play on the combine you can set it to whether you drive unloading or stop and unload whichever so he'll drive alongside him until he's empty which hopefully isn't too long no he could end up keep driving under no he's still going still emptying still empty yeah and now he's unloaded so after that then he'll wait for him to go out of the way and then he'll get a waypoint yeah a waypoint just taking a second now anyways a waypoint will come up there and then he'll drive to that waypoint see it there now and the waypoint can be anywhere it can often be in the way whether he runs into some trying to get to it or ends up running into the crop in the way of him turning around to come back and then after that you can hit drive now and then that's him saying go back to the start point run his course empty and unload and that's it that is it it's very straightforward it's easy peasy lemon squeezy and th that's really it there's nothing else to show as you can see there it's very straightforward he's going to run the course drive across tip it come back and ready for the next unload so I don't think there's anything else to explain so please subscribe and like subscribe to my channel so you can catch the next uh, part in the series for the next bit of course but I think the next I'm going to do is the overloading so that is it from me please like and subscribe to my channel good luck